Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Miss Carolyn and thank you for coming. Hopefully you'll subscribe. Today we are going to do we are going to do a review on Miss Rihanna Fenty Beauty. Um, you know she has a new scrub. And if you've been watching my channel, you know I'm all about the loving ourselves self-care this summer, keeping our body moisturized, keeping our face moisturized, keeping our lips moisturized, keeping this whole body moisturized and soft like a baby's bottom, right? So I ordered it and I got it within basically less than 48 hours. I love that, you know? I've never got any delivery that fast. Well, Amazon used to be like that. They're not like that no more. So this is a cherry dub. So I'm going to open it with you guys. I just took a shower. Um, I did wash my face because I feel that when you using anything, you make sure your face is clean from makeup, from anything. I have no makeup on. I was supposed to get my lashes done. Didn't work out, so I pulled them out. So this is my own lashes, which I use. I told you guys about this, right? Okay, let's get into it. So anyway, this new cherry dub scrub that Miss Fenty Beauty herself, which is Miss Rihanna, just lunch, excuse me, lunch, I think last week, and I got it within two days. The total amount for both, which I have the body scrub also. You know, I cannot get the face scrub without the body scrub. They both are cherry. And this is body scrub. And that one is a face scrub. Since it says cherry, let's see if it smells like cherry before we use it. Brand new. Have not been opened yet. Okay, let me see here. By the way, I'm in my bathroom because I'm about to wash my face since this is a review. Mm, I'm not smelling no cherry, but okay. So, let's get started. Um, before I usually put any scrub on my face, I usually wet my face a little bit because I want it to be a little moist from the water so it won't in case the scrub is a little you know rough i don't want it to be rough on my skin i just did my hair too i love this color i will talk to you about that in another video but let's get started Oops, let me turn off the water okay i'm liking it i'm liking it mm-hmm I'm looking at my other mirror, guys. If you see me looking kind of a weird way, so I can make sure I put it everywhere in my body. I mean, in my face. I don't want to mess up. Let me take this hair out the way. I'm not using too much, guys. It's just, I'm using a little dab. Hey guys, how are you? I wanted to add some more about um, Fenty's um, skin, Jerry the face scr um, scrub. It is gentle enough for everyday use. The Fenty Skin Cherry Dove Super Fine Daily Cleanser Face Scrub contain a dynamic mix of super fine physical okay, sugar okay. and silica and chemical exfoliate so that is a good thing guys that is a good thing description. i just open it up i should have read the description before i did the review but it doesn't matter i usually leave all my scrubs anyway for a minute or two in my face so i'll get back with you guys in a few all right i am back it's been two minutes two almost three minutes um, I wanted to also try my 24 karat gold underline for my eye. So we're going to try that too. I got this from Amazon. 
like I said, we're all about caring for our body, whereas your face, or doing something self-care for yourself. So, I'm going to put that here. And I know a lot of y'all like to look so weird, but who doesn't look weird when they're doing something like that? Oh my goodness. Okay, if you want me to link this on the description bio so you guys can buy it too, let me know. This is really good. I've been using this for about a year. There's other kind, and I do have other kind, but I like this one most because it stay. Okay. Okay, I'm going to let it stay for another five minutes. And then I'll get back with you guys. I did my hair today. Changed my hairstyle. I used to like dark hair, but I realized that um, lighter hair worked for me better. And I just like it. Just, I don't know, it bring, it makes my skin lighter. Not to say lighter, but I don't know. It just, I used to love it. Um, having my hair color, not color, but really dark. But I feel like when we... Um, my style, I'm, I'm a Leo, so Leo's like bright, vibrant things, even though I don't like a lot of vibrant things. My favorite color is gray and black, okay? So I'm an introvert Leo because I'm not out there partying like the rest of the Leos, these um, people, pe people person, socializing. I don't do that. Um, my life is very calm, quiet. I don't uh, be out there. You know, twerking it like some of these Leos do. I mean, it's fine, you know, it's fine. I mean, it is what it is. So, those people. <laughs> it is what it is. Everybody have their own fun way of living their life. Me, my fun is chillaxing at home, um, drinking some wine, watching a movie, you know, Netflix or other, um, other channels. Sometimes I'll be on social media just to look, not really post anything. And right now, like I say, my life is really busy. Uh, I run a business, a small business, and I'm going to school full time. So it's kind of hard, but I am going to be traveling next month in July with my daughter. We are going to see the, um, we're going to see, we're not going to go see the Great Canyon, but we're going to go see the Antelope Canyon. And Arizona uh, we've been to Arizona before we did the air balloons and that was the most amazing experience if you ever think about going to Arizona go to do the air balloon activity it is the most ex most amazing experience you will ever have so we're going to go see the Antelope Canyon and take pictures do hiking you know, check all the mountains, just a breath of fresh air, enjoying ourselves. She's never been there, so I want to take her there. And after that, I'm going to go to New York uh, for my birthday in August. And maybe I'll go with my sister, I don't know, uh, or by myself. I've never traveled by myself before, so it would be nice to do something by myself. Um... What else I could talk about while we wait? <laughs> oh, I know I look funny and weird, guys, but it's beauty, beauty. You gotta look beautiful. We women love beauty when we love looking good, so that's what I gotta do. But yeah, I did my hair today. It's a different style. This is a, actually, this is a synthetic lace wig. Now, if you guys want me to do a tutorial about synthetic, because people be thinking like, oh, synthetic, mm, it doesn't last. But I do wear 100% human hair too, lace wig, but not not every day, because I'm like, who's going to do that? Spending two, three 
I mean, two to six hundred, sometimes a thousand dollars on a lace wig. No, I'm all about saving money for traveling, I'm saving money for future um, life, retirement, um, you know, other things. You know, I don't mind spending money on something that I really want, but I'm not going to be spending six, five hundred dollars on a lace wig. That would not be me. I'm sorry, that would not be me because why? These synthetic wigs just work just fine. All you got to do is, once you done it, right, get you a, here's what I use. Where's my, um, I can't even find where I put it. I had it. Okay. I use this. I don't know if you've heard about this. So I roll it like this so the curls could stay, right? Roll all of them and tie it like this. And put a scarf, and I have a my best Barnett scarf right here. I use that, and I get up. This style, this wig, yes, synthetic wig, will last me maybe a week or two if I allow it, and if I take care of it well. And also, I could wash it and bring back the shine by by doing some um leave-in condition. So. I'm going to show you guys where I buy my synthetic wigs and I will show you a variety of them also so you could see like don't don't close your eyes on synthetic wigs cuz there are good hair too and I use synthetic wigs or any wigs for protective of my hair my I have natural hair I don't like to straighten out my hair and the last time I had cut it because it was too much heat I've been putting in my hair, so I'm not doing that. This summer is going to be about um, these hair and braids. I am trying to protect my hair from the heat, from anything that will braid her, because I have really thin hair, and I'm trying to grow it to make it more naturally thick, which it's been doing really well. So hopefully one day I'll show you guys, but in the meanwhile, you're going to get what you're going to get, okay? So... Like I said, we're all about the self-care, loving ourselves, traveling. If you've been looking at my vlogs, you know it's all about. I have not shown no travel because I have not traveled. But I am traveling next month. And I think I'm going to be traveling again twice next month. Um, my plan and my goal is to travel every month. Yes, every month on the weekend, though. You know, if you do it every month. Um, you could save money on a flight. There's some good flights out here. I want to travel every state, not country, state, because who's going to go another country for just, for just the weekend? That's stupidity. I'm sorry. I don't do that. Nah, if I have a, a boo that's got all the money that want to do that, okay, honey, let's go. But just a three-day weekend thing I want to do every month. That is my goal. I have a lot of gold this year I want to accomplish before 2024 because it seemed like it's coming real quick, right? Because what? Okay, like we in almost mid-June. It's not June. I'm mid-June yet, y'all. Almost. But it's still surprising me how time is flying. So make sure you do five things you always want to do before 2024. So you could say you did something. It don't have to be five. It could be three or two. But something that you always wanted to do. I always wanted to fly. I mean, fly out of a helicopter. Like Bundy jump. Hopefully I'm able to do that too. I don't know. It's one of my fears. I am afraid of heights. So... <laughs> But I want to accomplish a lot of stuff. As I was talking about Fenty Beauty, guys. Their new cherry dub. And what I like about it, it is a um, super shine facial. Fine. Super fine facial scrub for your face. As you can see, my face is drying up now. So we're about to wash it. I am going to take these off I had them long enough when I wash my face I wash my face um basically hey guys sorry 
one of my neighbors was calling me. I'm like, excuse me, I'm busy. But anyway, <laughs> I'm going to take this off. What I'm going to do, I don't usually like wash, wash my face. I wash my face, but I wash my face with a towel. So that's what I'm going to do right now. So I'm going to remove these. Remove this one. See? And now, that's how they look like when <laughs> you're done with them. Anyway, I'm wearing this towel up. And I'm going to remove the scrub off. I must say, it feels so good. The scrub feels so good. It's not irritated my skin because my skin is very sensitive. Um, the smell is not so strong because a lot of people don't like strong stuff in their face because they might have, the, I mean, the small, the, I can't even talk, I'm sorry, the scent. A lot of people don't like strong scent in their face. Oh, I'm about to wet my shirt. Mm -hmm. oh, somebody said that that Bob style I had last time make me look like an old lady. I don't care how I look because I love myself. Okay? I get up every morning feeling blessed to do my dream job. And I work out. I will be doing that workout too. <laughs> Another time. For you guys. Please subscribe, okay? I am trying to grow this channel. So the more you subscribe, the more I could have no more videos, ideas, things you may like, good deals. By the way, Rihanna, I'm sorry, say Rihanna. Fenty Beauty was $69 for both. For the body scrub and the fine face scrub, the cherry. They both are cherry, okay? I think I have cleaned my face completely. Okay, maybe I have some more. Up. right here mm -hmm. okay I'm completely done Completely, completely done now. Mm. Okay. I'm going to put my towel down. But look at my face. The glow of Miss Rihanna Beauty product. Fenty Beauty. I like it. 
Mm-hmm. Look at my skin, the glow, girl. Oh, look at the glow. That is right here. That is not nothing. It's like a beauty mark, birthmark. I had it for a long time. But it's not like serious. My mom had it too. As you can see, the scrub worked really good. I like it. I give it an A plus 10, 10. You know, I'm used to face scrub have that little tingle, minty feel. That's what I was hoping also to, with Fenty Beauty Scrub. But this is good too. You guys let me know what you think. Now that we are done with um the scrub wiping our face, I'm going to show you how I moisturize my face. How do I keep my face so clear and clean? I do not wash my face every day. No. That's not good. I don't wash my face every day. I mean, I do put like the wet towel, but like, you know, wash, wash. Every day, I don't do that. No. It's not necessary. But we do have dirt in our face when we go outside. I get it. So I usually use a towel. I'm still taking a, a towel. But that is it. Um, I use this serum right here, the vitamin C serum. I don't know if you guys can see it. So much light in here. Vitamin C serum. I did my nails today, guys. You see that? Vitamin C serum. I got this from Amazon. I've been using it for about six months now. The one I usually use, I don't have it no more, which is this one. This is my favorite. But they both work. It's called True Skin. Oh, excuse me. True Skin Vitamin C for your face serum. What is vitamin C, right? Vitamin C, it protects your skin from the sun. And also, it's a good hydrate for your skin and also keep your face brighter. Any um, dark spot, it also could help with that. But I've been using it for a while now. Oh, excuse me, y'all. I don't look like I still have stuff in my face. Like, what is going on, people? What is going on? Oh. Okay. So what I do is... I also use this. I know you guys use Fenty Beauty Creamer Moisturizer. But I use this on my face. Yes. I use this on my face. It does not irritate my face. It does not do anything to my face. But I use this on my face. But I use a little bit. So I'm going to show you guys how I use it. Since we are talking about Fenty Beauty today. So. See I don't got that much left. I need to order some more. So I use. Oh look at my. Oh my god my shirt is wet. Ugh. Anyway, I'll just get another one. So, I just use a little bit of this. You see it? Can y'all? Oh, sorry, y'all. It's a little, a little bit more because it's going to fall. Then, I use a little bit of Fenty Beauty Cream Moisturizer. And I do like this. And I just. Keeping your skin moisturized is important. We don't want, like I said, we don't want no dry skin. The heat will definitely keep your skin dry sometimes when you're in the sun a lot. Mm. 
Uh, don't forget my EOS moisturized lip gloss. Can you see the lips moisturized? Mm. All right. <laughs> Get ready for my silliness. I'm very silly too. But look, look how it works. Look at the shine on this skin. Look at this skin. Yes. <laughs> look at it. Um, oh. Look at the skin though. The glow. The glow. The glow, yeah, baby. The glow. Loving the glow, right? Okay, so I remember telling you guys about this QIC mascara. How do I use it? Oh, is that the one I like? Wait a minute, y'all. Well, one second, because I have two of them, and one of them, the. The brush is, this one is thin. One second. This is the one I use. This one. Okay. Anywho. This is the one I use. Because this one is, the brush is more thicker. Right, so I use it on my lash. Y'all pack into it. Cause this stuff works. So I don't like to wear fake lashes all the time. So that's what I use to make my lashes longer, thicker. And I love it, yes. Yes, I love it. I love it. Okay, I hope you guys love this review on Fenty Beauty. Um, Cherry's Dove Scrub Fine Face Scrub. Okay, I give it a 10 out of 10. I didn't have no issue with it. My face is not having no issue. Sorry guys. Anyway, still shine, the glow, and I use my serum, vitamin C serum, and also Fenty Beauty moisturizer cream. So, all right, guys, I'll see you in another time. Hope you guys like this little review. Thank you for coming and watching this video. Please subscribe for more. Oh, did I, let, let's, let's, let's see this hair, right? I know y'all want to see this hair. Like I said, I get it done. Oh, look at this. Okay. I got my hair done about an hour ago. I did it myself. Yes, it is a synthetic wig, but it's cute. She cute, right? She's really cute, right? Mm-hmm. It's about... Ooh. This is um 24 inch. Sorry, my light keep popping in and I don't know what's going on with the light. But this is 24 inches. The back. Look at the back boo. Yes. And when I don't feel like um putting it down, I put it like a ponytail like this. Oh, I can put it up like this, whatever style I want to, you know, you know, I will never do a wig 
total because when I do mine, it takes me a while. Not because I don't know, but it's just, uh, it's just, it's a lot. It takes me about maybe 20 minutes, 20, 30 minutes to do my install for my lace wig. It used to take me an hour when I first started. So I'm, I guess I am getting better at it. Do I want to do a tool, install a tool for you guys? I don't think so. <laughs> I'm not the install girl, so y'all would not see an install tool lace wig in this channel. No. You'll see traveling, talking about beauty, self-care, loving ourselves, being happy with ourselves. Oh, I love this color. Oh, such a summer color, right? Y'all see my earrings? I love them. Right? I would show you my whole outfit, but I'm not wearing the bottom. <laughs> this was about the face, people. Not about my body, so no reason to show anything. Plus, I'm see, I see a little bit too much, right? Any, any Creole people over here? Anybody that speak Creole or French? Um, anybody that's Haitian? I'm Haitian, yes. My parents are Haitian. My dad is Haitian, so I am Haitian. Popcorn George, okay? If you think you're coming over here to be rude and disrespect, you will get blocked. I am a loving, positive woman, and I want to stay that way. I don't need no negative energy in my life or anything. I, You know what? Let's talk about this. Is it me? But since I've been single, I, I love it. Um... Before, I used to hate being single. I used to hate being alone. Um, I felt like I always needed somebody because all my friends are married or they're, they're have a relationship. You know, I've had a relationship before. I was dating this Nigerian guy. If y'all want that story, please subscribe. I will tell you guys. Now, not all Nigerian men are bad, okay? Like, not all men are bad. Every man have their whatever. We're not here to bash no man. I love all men, black or white. I don't care as long as they treat me well. Okay? So, he is a Gemini. If you ever date a Gemini, God bless you. God bless you because it is a fact. They have two personalities. <laughs> like, no freaking joke. They have a personality that will be like, am I lost? Am I confused? What is going on here? You're going to be like that. But that is another story. Let's talk about being single. Since I've been single, I've been getting a lot of men trying to talk, take me on a date, all that stuff, and I like it, you know, I like it, I think I'll go on a date here, now, and there, but this singleness is truly different, and it's like, I love it, I love it, I don't know what is going on, I'm loving my stuff, I don't know what is going on, but I love it, you know, I feel like I'm loving me for once. Because when I'm in a relationship, I'm all about my man. My man, my man, my man. Taking care of him. Any mean necessary. Because I feel like when you truly care about somebody, I'm like, you make sure they, they're happy. Whether it's cooking dinner for them, bringing them breakfast in bed, you know, uh, doing the girlfriend duties. I know they say... Um, certain things you should not do with your man if you're not married with them. I'm old school. My mom and my dad, I don't know. They, sh <laughs> they, you know, so I don't know. Maybe that's probably why 
these men be treating me because I be um, taking care of them. They are so spoiled. I spoil my man. I spoil my man. And that's one thing I'm going to have to cut back when I get in a relationship in the future, whenever that is, because it's not right now, though. It's not right now. This summer is all about me enjoying life. And just because I say I am single, I will not be jumping to these dating with men and having sex like it's all good. No. My health matter. My life matter. I am I'm, I am not about to be fucking anybody while I am single like it's okay. No. Only time I be out there like that when I'm in a relationship, a serious relationship, we're going to do what we're going to do. That's our business. But while I'm single, I'll just go on dates, have fun, laugh. Does not mean I will be fucking you. No. Excuse me, you too. I know you say no cursing. All right. No cursing. I will not be doing that. But I am going to. Uh, I'm obsessed with this hair. Sorry. But I am going to, you know, have fun, enjoy, drink some wine, dance, maybe tour. I don't know. But I am not gonna be putting my focus on any man. This year, my focus will be about me, my business, my child, and my school. I only have one more year to graduate. I don't need no distractions. Thank you very much. Okay? But anywho, <laughs> I was, I'm sorry guys. I was supposed to talk about but I was saying, what I was saying also too is, since I've been single, like men want to be in a relationship. It's so weird. They want to be in a relationship. And it's surprising me, honestly, because I be thinking like not all men want relationship. Because when I'm a relationship girl, you know, I'm committed to my man. It's my man, my man. It's all about him and us. That's it. Period. But since I've been single, most of the men I've been meeting, they want a relationship. They want to do this and that. And I'm like, this girl is not about that this year. Um, when she was about that relationship, y'all didn't want a relationship. But now everybody want a relationship. I was at Menard. Menard is a... Um, y'all might not have Menard around you guys. It's like a place where you buy electrical stuff, you know, home improvement type of um, store. This dude helped me. Mind you, he worked there. I don't know he was a supervisor. So I don't know what was I thinking. He was helping me with something and he's like, can I get your number? And I'm like, you know what? I, I'm not giving you my number because, you know, there's no reason to because ain't nothing going to happen because I'm not looking for anything. But he's like, you need, you might need a friend. You might need this. I'm like, what part of not giving you my number? He's like, well, come on, please. And I'm like, these dudes out here don't know the meaning of no. I said, no, I'm not giving you my number. And that is it. And he still kept going and going trying to get my number. It was just so annoying. So I didn't know what to do. I gave him my number. And he texted me within 30 minutes after I gave my after I gave him my number. And I'm like, really? You couldn't even wait maybe uh, the next day or something. Text me. I know we we didn't collide or connect about about me and you in the store. Me and you? There's no me and you, boo. What? And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna block him because. I don't want to give him the the idea that me and him are going to have something going on. So I sent him a nice little text and I say, I am sorry. I am all about my me to this year and self-care, taking care of me. I am sorry. Whoever for me will be for me, but it won't be right now. It won't be right now. Guys, do you see this skin? Is this glowing? Glowing, 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 what? 
look. Okay, Miss Fenty, Miss Rihanna. Mm. Or oh, it could just be my vitamin C. My moisturized skin, moisturize, I tell you, ladies. And men, moisturize your face and body, okay? <laughs> Anywho, let me get out of here. I talk enough. You guys have a wonderful weekend. I will be doing more vlogs if you guys like. So please subscribe. Thank you for watching my channel. Bye. I was trying to wake my eye. Bye. Okay, guys. I want to show you what I am wearing. Hey, guys. I wanted to show you what I was wearing. As I did just do a review on Miss Rihanna and her Fenty Beauty scrub we just was talking about. I'm still in the bathroom. I just thought you guys might want to see what I was wearing. So, love my earrings, right? But anywho, this is my little... I have to do it like this because I don't be feeling my stomach. I still need to... Uh, that's another... Anyway, this is so cute. I love this little orange, little tight. I got these from Amazon. And I love these kind of sweaters because it's really you know casual but not too casual you know so that's what i am looking at looking like this is just a little filter to show you guys but as i was saying before my daughter interrupt me <laughs> i don't like my stomach but i'm working on it i do work out five days a week i was thinking about lipo because it's not flat every day it's what I'm wearing that's flattening it out. You know, after I had a baby, which was a long time ago, but my stomach has not been the same. But I still love it. You have to love you, and it's okay to change whatever you want to change. It's your body, so who's going to check you? Who's going to check you, boo? You want big boobs? Get big boobs. You want a big ass? Get big ass. You want whatever you want? Just make sure you did your research. Check, because people are dying from surgery, so don't play with your body, okay? You only have one life to live. Make sure it's worth it. Me, I'm okay. Okay, people. Like I said, it is your body. And if you want to change it, change it. Whatever you want to do with it is your business. You grow, do whatever you want. Me, I am going to continue to work out five days a week until... I see some change, and who knows, maybe I'll get some lipo since it's my stomach. Maybe not, I don't know, I don't care. But it's my body, so I can do whatever I want with my body, right? But I'm gonna still do my research, like make sure this surgeon is what it is. He say what he is, he's professional, he has license, and communicate with other people who have worked with him. You know, just for safety precaution, but it's not something that I want to do right now, but maybe in the near future. But right now, I'm loving me. It is what it is. Did I tell you guys how much I love this blue, this color? Ooh, and look at that. What? Can't tell me nothing. Tell me what? I look good. I know I do. Don't hate. <laughs> Y'all have a good weekend. Subscribe. Thank you for coming. Mm -hmm.